Hey guys, Finlox here, back with our semi-blind playthrough of Morrowind. Everything should be working, no guarantees. With me today's Manny, he's here in my lap like a cutie. Last time we did that one Thieves Guild quest, which was honestly a bit underwhelming, but at the same time, kind of makes a lot of sense. You know, because you're you're trying to establish yourself as the rival criminal syndicate to the Kamana Tong, so you're not just necessarily moving in the shadows. You can kind of move a little bit openly as well, I suppose. And me being the new guy, I'm, they're like, "Yeah, new guy, go take care of this stuff. Maybe you won't make it, but that's okay." And here we are doing. Sort of the next story quest. I do want to do these, but uh, we'll we'll get back to Aldrun eventually, right? Uh, so, yeah, Gramazgab. Right, we have to go to the Adrano ancestral tomb and get the skull of Lavul Andrano. I have no problem recognizing from the ritual markings, and then maybe it would be neat if they be neat if they teach me some sort of. Uh, Necromancy or something. All right, let's uh, let me drink a little bit of coffee. And uh, ooh, that's that's hot. Hot, 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 hot. I just made it, but it's like I'm you know I'm due for my morning coffee several hours ago, so I'm presumably getting a little bit of headache from that. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. Cafe Bustelo. If you haven't had it, it's it's pretty good. It's like an espresso blend. It's really nice. Super smooth. Right, Manny? You don't need to look up at me. You can go back to your little nap. God, just want to make sure I don't look a booger on my face or something. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Not, not a fan of the whispers. Gotta say. How close to a level are we? Two, two things. Probably easy enough to get a sneak if we kind of crouch around. Ooh, that's it looking interesting, like swirls and stuff. But I'd like more spear. The more spear that I could get, because... You know, it's not necessarily a guarantee. Oh, there's a ghost. And more than a ghost, I hear things walking around. Dead body. Looks like an orc, maybe. Just dead body, no name or anything? Chitin short sword, iron tower shield. Two of them. Why would you have two shields? And no other armor. Oh yeah. I'm wearing an expensive shirt, but extravagant pants. Expensive shoes. We'll take the gold. None of this stuff is really worth grabbing. Ironically, except for the pants, but I wanted those. You know, do we... What if I wanted to give him... Okay, sorry, dude. <laughs> Did they do that on purpose where there was like a ghost and it moved away? Earn bone meal. Sure. And we have a shrine so that if we want to. Not just yet. Presumably, we're going to get some sort of blight disease in here. And that'll be bad. Wooden door. See, this I think is an interesting little dungeon layout. 
I, I must still be in the intro area because... Oh, hey, buddy. Ah, oh, crap. Maybe it would have been okay. Maybe I... Maybe I shouldn't have attacked it. It didn't say that I... Do I have a bounty on me now or anything? No. Alright, fair enough. Cobwebs. What is that? A skeleton? Oh, well, there's a skeleton. There's a couple of them. Crippled skeleton. Iron halberd, iron shield, no. I'm surprised I had the shield, though. And these just have... I mean, I, I get it, right? It's ashes. I'm basically stealing ashes out of the tomb. Wow, that's kind of nice. I don't know what this is supposed to be. Oh, really? That's the whispers, so the ancestors are actually active here? Oh. Oh, well. Oh, ouch. Skeleton archer. Wow. Okay. And a longbow, if, you know, if you wanted it. Weakness to shock and shock damage. We'll definitely take all of those. Do I want to take the longbow? Um, it's eight. I mean, I guess it would be nice to have the option. You know what I really need to do is go back to that, um, Where was it? I guess it was Ebonheart, so we could sell the glass frost sword. Cause so far that that one that one Smith that had thirty five hundred, they that's the most. And I'm like, I'm not using this. Here you go. You know. Um I'll I'll say no. I'll just I'll sell the arrows. Oh sorry, mister. He's all He's like scratching his ear. Yep. Well, that was interesting. The arrows that had the issues. Where? All right, well, let's go here because this might be a... All right, cool. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta think about this as Ghoul hearts. Oh man, these are probably I am I'm I feel like I'm doing something really terrible here. I'm like because their ancestors are like this is sacred to the Dunmer, you know what I mean? I'm doing really, really bad stuff right now. I'm like, oh, oh you left these little offerings for your your dead one. This is like uh yeah, I mean, it's not like... Gah. Okay, repair prongs, hammer, Nordic battle axe, eh. We'll take those. Yeah, see, it's not... This stuff is not super great. Silver dagger. Uh, yeah, okay. No, 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 no. Take all of it. And... Chokeweed. 
I mean, I'm taking bone meal. Okay, what about you? Oh. Oh, this goes down. So these overlap. Okay, well, I'll, I'll come back for that. Oh, they do overlap. Hey, buddy. Yep, Violet Caprinus. Druax. Iron Spear. Take the Bone Meal. I don't know why I'm taking the Bone Meal. I'm not gonna... Oh, come on. Am I stuck? Oh my gosh. I might be stuck. No effect. Fair enough. Uh, and I don't think we've gotten... Cursed or anything like that. Fire salts. Damn, they're getting... Wow, that's... Yeah, I'm like stealing the offerings for the ancestors. That's... And what is this supposed to be? I, I mean, I assume it's enchanted magically. Oh, what was that? That looked like it had a little bit more meat on it. Okay. And that dude's shooting at me. Oh, hey, buddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. A bone walker. You've contracted brown rot. And I'm over encumbered. Okay. Brown rot is bad. What is brown rot? Is it a regular? Well, let's try common disease. I assume it's a blight disease, but, but who knows? Okay. We'll try regular common disease first. I suspect it's... You know, it's interesting. Even, like, looting their bodies, you can get the diseases. So that's bad. I might... I was like, why would I need a, a spell of diseases or prevent disease? Well, that's why. Resist disease, right? Because... Oh, that's... that's far down. Oh, there's like a book or something. That's... huh. Oh, cruel shard arrow. Wow. Longbow. Another longbow. Okay. We'll... Well, and that's the other thing. It's like... You know, these spells cost a fair amount, so you can't just, like, be using them for a bunch of stuff, you know? We're gonna run to somewhere. I don't know where we are. If we're close to... If we're close to Sedanin, which, yeah, it's right there, then we'll do that. We'll sell all this stuff. Give you a soothing balm. Okay. Yeah, diseases are bad. And the... F <coughs> Sorry. Rest and meditate on what you've learned. Ah, crap. What was my, uh... Could have probably gotten more spear out of it, but... 
It's too late now. Let's run back to... Wait, where am I going? I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? We'll go to St. Anine. We'll go to that um, little bedroll. We'll save... I didn't pass it already, did I? Son of a bitch! Oh, it's the one the Netch is guarding. Okay, that makes sense. Right, because there was a rat there. There was a rat there before I leveled up. Right, so that brown rot reduces your strength. That's bad. Luckily, it's cure common. It is a common disease. It's not a blight disease. So that makes sense. Uh, but yeah, had I been able to walk to the um that little shrine right there, I would have done so. You know, a little bit disappointed that um that cure common disease spell didn't work because it had. 50% chance. I, I, I know realistically you're not entitled to get it automatically if you get a... Yes. You know, cast it twice with a 50% chance, you're not entitled to yes. get it. That's just how... It's just how the roll... You have something to say. It's how the roll of the dice is. All right, let's see what we get this time. Rest until healed. You've ascended to level seven. You resolve to continue pushing yourself. Perhaps there's more to you than you thought. All right, so strength and intelligence, and then see endurance is still, I bet if I had gotten that other spear thing instead of restoration, which I should have been paying more attention, I suppose, then I would have gotten a fourth point of endurance. But I mean, you know, we're, we're doing what we can. We're doing what we can, that's all you can do. Man, this is good coffee. And you are a warm kitten. All right. 89. That's a... But the brown ones seem to last longer. Did I? Let's try talking to this dude about uh, fifty-nine, I guess. I I could have sworn I saw something there, and then it went away. Yes, this is Morrowind. Hmm. Hmm. All right, whatever. How much was this LimeWire thing? 650, that's not, I mean, it's fantastic for like now. I mean, it's fantastic even now, but your papers, please. I suppose it is my duty to help those less fortunate than myself. Speak freely, friend. You know, it's kind of funny, like, there's so many people that think like she does, where they look down on others. Speak to um, me. And it's just, it, like I said, it's funny because I think it was... Which of the Deus Ex? Human Revolution? I think it was Human Revolution. You get that, um... That little implant that lets you kind of manipulate people a bit better. You know, and it... Categorizes them into three types of personalities, and it's like... You know, this is how you should address... Each of those. You know, and... As a result of that, I've sort of started to look at people in that way, because it... It's kind of true. It's not always true, but it's like, you know, if you want something from someone and they think they're they're super, they're all that, and they think you're beneath them, then it's like, oh, you appeal to their sense of 
you know, pride. All right, so let's barter. He's got 800 gold. We're going to sell him all these arrows. 66. We'll sell him all of these other arrows. Holy poop. Look at that. 604. Now, can I... Do you have any potions or anything? Um, civic intervention. Oh, I should use some of these. Fortified personality. Oh, unhinging? Yeah, we probably should get more of those. Argent claw. Oh, he restocks them. So not... All right, well, we'll get more of Argent Glow, not Argent Claw. Sorry. Yeah, these are pretty awesome. All right, let's sell the Silver Dagger. We'll sell the Shard Arrow. Right, right. Um... Yeah, we're just we're just sort of laundering all this stuff. Okay, Ghoul Heart. Just one. Sell all the bone meal. Alright, so we have the Alm Civi intervention. See, that's what I need to use more. Although, I mean well. The potions weigh more. Well, those are blight disease. And that's value of 20. Value of 40. It doesn't matter, you know. Unhinging. Didn't I get more than that? I thought I got more than that, but maybe not. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I took I took the pants and I put my other pants on the dude. We have two rings, a belt, and an amulet. So, wait, what is this? Oh, that's right, right, right. That's what we're buying. I'm like, why does it look odd? And then we have the extra hammers and all stuff. I have nine thousand gold. That's out freaking standing. You know what, let's, yeah, let's do that. Let's see if we can get one extra. No, damn it. All right, it's fine. I was really hoping, because he doesn't have potions. Actually, I take that back, he does. But it's all the local, oh yeah, the slave stuff. No, he doesn't have, um, like a lot of good. The best thing he has are scrolls. Those scrolls. Alright, now. Serious question. Should I run to... I think it's Ebonheart. I'm going the wrong way, first off. Should I run there and just dump off this sword that I'm never going to use? Yeah. Make it quick, Outlander. Just sell it at a loss. How heavy is it? 12 pounds. That's, I mean, it's something, you know? My thought is... Probably. Let me, let me use, um... Okay, that's fine. Oh, now we gotta jump everywhere. All right, so strength. Strength, we're good. We have... <sighs> I'm sort of annoyed by that because it means I have to pick it for three more levels. Although, I, I, maybe I could just do it at 99. So let's, let's jump everywhere. We need to get to 68 or some variation thereof. The fact that it's one off 
triggers my... I was gonna say PTSD, but that's the wrong thing. Technically, I don't have PTSD. They changed the definition, so there you go. That's... Yeah, isn't that nice? It's like, you're cured! We changed the definition! It's like, that's... Doesn't help me. <laughs> yeah, let's take... Let's take this way. Right, we also need to think about what we want for the next... What we want to raise for the next level. Obviously strength. Strength and endurance, but then what? Probably personality, I'm thinking. We gotta look for... I'm thinking speech craft. I don't know where there would be a speech craft tra trainer. We could actually go... Since we're gonna go to Ebonheart, we could actually check... Oh, are we getting attacked? Oh, well, crap. That's cool. Probably could have let him just beat on us for a little bit. I was... See, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Our spear is like almost 50. So we actually hit regularly. Our stamina was super low. Stamina was super low. But we still hit two out of three times, maybe? And our strength was high enough that the hit mattered. I hear a Kwama. Yeah, I would like to... Ish, the creaking. I would like to clear out the, um... That place today. That tomb. Unfortunately, we have to... We now have to hop. Man, those arrows were lucrative. Hey, we still have to go to Vivek. I want to do that pilgrimage. I want to do... I want to do all the things. You know, I suspect this is going to be like... 300 episodes, which is... I don't know what to think about that, if that's the case. I'm already... I haven't actually published any of these yet, and this is almost episode 60, so we're... Yeah, it's, uh... It's gonna be challenging, because my hard drive is basically full... And I have to basically keep deleting stuff that's been uploaded but hasn't been published. And so I'm not 100% certain it works. And BitChute, I gotta say, is not the most reliable. Because it's mostly peer-to-peer -peer and, you know, so I uploaded some stuff and then just for whatever reason it... It wasn't playing the episode. It would play some episodes, but not all. And I'm like, I'm like, what's going on? And then it, I, I don't know. But she was just being weird. I was like, do I need to re-upload some of these? And and then a few hours later, they worked. And I'm like, okay, this makes. I mean, it had to. I assume Bitchute was overloaded or something. I was like, wait, is this guy coming for me? I haven't seen him come that far out the gate before. Oh. I, I hope it's here where that smith was. The one with the, the face. The weird face mask. If it's not them, then I don't know. Yes. If you want something, now's the time to talk. Okay, well. I was really hoping for whatever reason you were a trainer that I hadn't talked to before. Alright, so it is you. Cool. Uh you can train me. 
but not on anything that I want at the moment. And see, if I wanted to buy some of these other things, I certainly could. Glass arrows, for example. You have 3,500. If I sell you this, you'll give me... What was my uh, disposition? Okay, so you'll probably give me about a third at the moment. Which would be... Normally about 5,000, I think. Oh, geez, about seven. Well, that's a problem. Maybe I could just purchase all these steel arrows from you. You don't have to go, Mr. Manny. You don't have to go. He's going, though. He's going somewhere. Just waiting. Because he's like half awake, he's blinking and stuff, and he's looking at the the jump from here to the chair. He's like, do I want to make it? No, not yet. No. Not yet, mister. You don't have to, you know. You could have stayed in my lap. Where you are warm and cute, and you probably hear him rubbing his face against the microphone. I can move the mouse a little bit. So, my thought. Oh, that's not very much. Okay, well, let us, we'll purchase everything light that we can. Silver bolt. Glass arrows. Silver arrows. Okay, it's getting better. I could purchase two iron arrows. These were the ones that I think I stole and... <sighs> what else? Any other silver stuff? Imperial silver hem helm. Huh. I mean, that's true. It's heavy armor. I could just purchase this. It's one pound heavier than that other one was, I think. Okay. Do you have any steel dagger, steel crossbow? Oh, silver staff. Silver short sword, silver long sword, silver dagger, silver claymore. We are running out of steel katana. Yeah, weapons are heavy though. Oh, I have chitin boots. How much are these netch? Weight eight, armor five. Okay, definitely need the chitin boots. Anything I have that's leather? Eh -eh. All right, and then there's the chain greaves. <sighs> Actually, no, armor rating for this is 17. Armor rating for this is 11. So, yeah, but... Okay... Right, the demon katana. I mean, we could purchase that back. Yeah, exactly. How about no? The jinx sword, but yeah. I mean, we're sort of losing a little bit of money. Uh, imperial chain. Huh. There's a difference between chain and plate? Or what am I looking at here? Okay. So I basically need another thousand. We're not 
we're not gonna get it, but... Okay, silver... Silver Claymore it is probably one of the better ones. Bone Mold Longbow. Oh, it's probably better than a regular Longbow. That's what it seems. Alright, how are we doing as far... We have like six pounds left that we can... Yeah, I don't know if the Silver Staff would be something that we could purchase. Oh, Silver Short Sword is more economical anyway, so let's... Let's do that, and then let's... Oh, we could sell the Hound Bean, I suppose, but they don't... Yeah, they don't buy that. Okay, well... Then we're gonna, uh... Oh, maybe I could sell... I suppose I could sell my boots. Oh, there's my... My little pinkies. My bare little feet. <laughs> All right, well, we have free, uh, we freed up some space now. Chitin Greaves, which are light. And then the Cuirass, yeah. Chain Coif. Okay, no other steel stuff, right? Or, sorry, silver. Oh, we should probably get some of these. They're only one, and the value is a hundred. That alone would would help. Uh, okay, let's buy all those. Okay, we could sell. And then what do we want to get rid of? Two for forty. Sure, sold. How we doing? 31. All right, let's, uh... Bam. All right, now, now what do I do? Uh, huh. Who would be able to purchase this stuff now? Oh, well, first... Yep, there's my... Look at those toes. Everyone's like, why are you walking around with bare feet? There we go. Alright. You can see the pants, too. Stylish. <laughs> um, I mean, it... What about Balmora? I don't want to go there. That's a ways off, but we need we need someone that we can sell a bunch of this stuff to. And I don't know if your trainer. Mysticism Enchant Destruction. What about you? You are not a trainer. You're Joslin. What about Oh, there was a dude upstairs, wasn't he? Agning. Will you buy? No. No. Will you buy? You will buy the Drew Wax. Crap, I bet we have to go to Balmora. That's disappointing. Wait. Wait, what, there was a downstairs? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. There was another Legionnaire. <laughs> I don't remember what he trained in. You but... want something, friend? Yes. Mercantile speechcraft or marksman. Yes, I would like speechcraft. Okay, so this is interesting because it seems like it's your chance of doing a speech check. Not necessarily affecting disposition. I assume that's a personality thing. But this is probably your success rate. Uh, which means we'll go from 
less than abysmal to just abysmal. All right, so what do I what do I have for speechcraft first? Uh, speechcraft right now is six. I don't know how. So we want it to go to 16. Maybe the bribes. I bet bribes fall under that. Because it's still uh, some sort of influencing, right? My power is the power of money. All right, so we're going to go to 16. started walking away while we're... Oh, interesting. It's ramping up a lot faster, though. Increase to 10. 11. 12. Ooh. Oh, because he's walking around. Time is passing, essentially. Yeah, this is... Okay. 16, there we go. What are we down to now for gold? Did that take 11k? So we were at 9... 9.5. Then we got another 3,000. So we're at 12.5. Wow, so just purchasing from this dude, just that training, cost... 1,200? Is that about right? Yeah, I think so. Wow. Still worth it. Worth it if I can go... Now, I mean, I assume maybe it affects bribes as well. Maybe if you're like, here's a bribe, it affects how much the disposition increases. You are right, Nanny? Yeah, he didn't want to. He didn't want to jump. It's understandable. Talk is free. What do you want? We could go to Pelagiad. There's well, there's shops there, and that's pretty close. We don't have to go to back to Balmora. Sedanin, that dude. We sold him. I'm. There we go. We gotta get to 68. What was that? Man, that bone walker, that sucked. Like all of a sudden I couldn't move because I'm over encumbered. <sighs> um, but yeah, the Satanine dude. That would be good if, I mean, well, not just because it gives me a good price for all that stuff, but also because he would hold on to it. But then again, I guess if they just restock their arrows, then it's not a huge deal. So let's see if we can sell all this stuff at Lagiad. God, look at the time. I feel like I take forever. I mean, I I guess I do, but it's like... Do I have a... Well, no, no, no. I don't necessarily want to lean into the restoration. I'm like, oh, I, was, I think I have a spell for stamina. And I, I believe I do, but... Well, it's only a 22% chance and it'll use all of my magicka. Just about 30 out of 40, which... I mean, that's, that's quite a lot. It's more... That's why I wanted to focus on, you know, the physical combat aspect, because magic is nice, but it's not that you can necessarily... Presumably, that's why they have all the enchanted items. You know, get a ring that can shoot a fireball, because... You know, you have your Magicka, but you have a lot of other things you can do, you know? Well, then, presumably, it 
costs less. I, I don't know if this... If you're better at that alteration skill, for example, example is your uh, using the lock spell, does that cost less then? I know it has a higher success rate, but... Oh, we got Kaguti. We got another one over there somewhere. I heard a, a Kwama. Oh, that's what that sound is. Am I gonna get attacked by two? Wow, they can see you from a distance. Well, there is the hide, but we are full, and so we do not need... Oh, crap. Something saw me. Oh, oh, I wondered. I was like... I was looking around, I was like, okay. Now, racer plumes, on the other hand, are probably worth... Uh... Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Let's see. Do I have anything I can use this on? Well, yeah. There you go. They're going to be like... They're gonna be like, why why does this cliff racer have a a partially used hammer on it? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, it's over there. We're gonna take the right. We're following the roads. Yeah, I'm actually really excited to play this game. I was... It sounds strange, maybe. God, there's more cliff racers. Why? Is that what happens? Everything just turns into a cliff racer the higher level you become? Why are they not, and the mud crabs not fighting? What is that? I just remember seeing the... There was a dude... He had something that, like... It's one of those meme videos where he modded Morrowind so that he had something that would... Maybe summon cliff racers, like, not on his side, just create them. And then something that doubled the number of, of them that there were. Until eventually he's like running away from this giant like tornado of of cliff racers. It's kind of funny. Alright, so now all we have to do basically is sell all of this stuff. We have to keep jumping to level up our acrobatics, aka our strength. And then use the spear yes. and heavy armor to get uh right, that dude. You think he knows that we were the one? Presumably, presumably the armor. Hey, look at that. Look at that little stuff. What's up, dude? Pleased to meet you, stranger. You're planning to be in Pelagia long, then you'll want to know where the services are. Well. Fair enough. So he doesn't super like us a lot, but he has a decent amount of gold, so let us... And he won't buy... No, he doesn't buy that. But does he buy... A silver helm. Yes, he will. He'll probably put it on here in a second, too. Silver short sword. And then I will try and sell him all of these arrows and darts and other stuff. Now, what's going to be interesting is, will he will he keep these? Because I know pawnbrokers do, but do average bone mold boots. Oh, those are medium. Right bracer, left bracer. That's cool. And 
steel bolt. Bam. The claymore. Could I? Hmm. I was like, can I purchase anything from him? Does he? But no, probably not. Because I think everything that he would sell, I don't, I don't really need. See, this is why I'd probably want to... Should I just cancel and just run to Balmora? Because I'd get way more money. And the dude has a bigger... Um... God, I hate this. I hate being... What I'm willing to do for an extra... Probably double what he's going to give me, to be honest. Right? Because Balmora is not that far away from this. Okay, fear not, Manny. Your dad is not going to become a rabbit. Oh, okay, it's it's dead. I was like, I was like, hang on. Oh, there's another one over there. Don't worry, we'll fight. We'll fight another one here in a second. Oh, oh, that's a, okay, that's a mud crab, or, no, it's a scrib, sorry. There is a mud crab over there, but that's, uh... Oh, here it comes. All right, mister, you just stay there for a moment. Yeah, I get you. Oh, I can't, I'm not, uh... I just wonder it's very strange it's like there's there's times where I'm like where I'm like wow that's farther than I thought and then times where I'm oh my gosh another cliff racer what are they doing they're taking over the area what is going on that's what levels do just turn things into cliff racers and then how long until they get diseased and as well, and you just... Oh, are you going to attack me also? Until cliff racers are diseased, and then they have multiple diseases, and then they just... They see you, and just being near you, they just give you diseases, and you get all the diseases. Every disease, everywhere, all at once. That's right. Succumb to the pokey stick. Why is my why is my weight limit less now? Oh, because of the hammer. Because the hammer was like three pounds or four pounds or something. Now on the plus side, once we get our strength all the way up, I guess we'll we'll continue to run everywhere. But that'll be more tolerable because then we'll be wanting to increase our agility slowly. <sighs> How long until there's a Kakuti like right over there that just charges us? The Netches are Actually, the reason they're floating is because they're full of cliff racers. It's not even that the cliff racers are, are bad, necessarily. It's just that they're flying, and they're everywhere, and they see you, and they're like, Alright, I'm going. It's go time. So this used to be a Kagudi, but now it's back down to a Kwama, which is 
strange to me. Right? That... Hmm. So I guess maybe it's like, well, okay, if it's a Kagudi, then it changes. Maybe it rolls over to a Kwama, and then maybe we're at a different tier now or something. You know, the enemies are reset, except for certain enemies, which are now even tougher or something. I don't know. Or maybe now it's going to become a Kwama, and then the next time it'll be something worse. I don't know. Two cliff racers. Who knows? There's still that lady somewhere near Aldruin, was it? The one that wants to go to the ghost shrine. And I'm just like, yeah, no, I don't want to go to the ghost shrine. I still need to go to Coal Cave. That might be easier now. God, it's time to stop. All right, we'll get to... Let's run a little bit. Awesome. Hey, look at that guy walking on the pillar. All right, all the way back to Balmora. We could sell him. Oh, Outlander. Did you want something? So what's this about? Let's see. You think he's going to put on the... Steel Helm, I would say yes. 61s, there you go. Silver Short Sword. Silver Claymore. All the darts. All the arrows. The other arrows. Bolts. More arrows. More bolts. Okay, what about all of those? That's good. We still have the racer plumes and stuff, but he doesn't take that. Does he buy... Let's see, we're at a thousand. We could we could maybe just sell him all these hammers. As far as I'm concerned, I'm not really using them. Okay, a little too much. Little too much. Um Oh no no. Uh mm. I don't know. Four? 2009. Let's get another one. Okay. And then... Uh, disposition, so maybe... I think... Maybe, let's try 75. That's probably too much, but we'll try it. Okay, good. And there he's wearing the helm. Alright, well, at least we got a bunch more armor. Look at you. <coughs> I'm your best person ever, because you are now... You're a, you're a fancy lad. That's what you are. All right, where are we going? We could hit the bed while we're here. Can you ask your question quickly? I must be going. Hit up the bed while we are here. Bam. We are now healed. And now we got to run all the way back to that tomb, but we're yes, out of time for today. So let us We'll just get to the edge of town. Get to the edge of town. Right there. See the Silt Strider. Give it a minute. Sold him a bunch of stuff, which he's happy about. That's And I got some more money, which makes me happy because, man, that's only the beginning levels. Imagine going from... Well, and it depends on the disposition. And I wonder if it depends on whether it's a, a major or minor skill as well. Right? That's, uh, yeah. Because it seemed like some of our, our higher skills up here, even Sneak was only like 180. Oh, wait. Maybe some of these block or whatever, but those are, well... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how that works. 
Regardless, speechcraft is up a little bit, so it'll be personality, strength, and hopefully, hopefully some good endurance. But anyway, uh, anyway, guys, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. Really do appreciate it. Really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. As always, guys, questions, comments, concerns, good, bad, or indifferent, let me hear them. I do want to hear all of them. I do try and read all of them. I do try and respond to all of them as well. What's your guys' unique positive moment for today? For me, it's the fact that I'm basically, well, I'm sort of on vacation at the moment. Uh, my sister's visiting, so it's more of a staycation. She'll be here for a few days, and then I'll go back to work. So a little short vacation, which will hopefully be low stress because uh, both my sisters are kind of crazy. So we'll see. We'll see. Uh, but that's my unique pause moment. Hopefully your guys is just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. Hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys, take care.